Aliens! Today, we're learning about float and sink. Now, what does float and sink mean? Float means when an object is placed on the surface of water, it will stay above it. And when we say sink, when an object is placed on the surface of water, it goes under it. Now, when does an object float and sink? An object will float if it is less dense than the liquid it is placed in. While an object will sink if it is more dense than the liquid it is placed in. Dense means it is tightly packed inside. Now, if you look over here, chameleons, I have a fun experiment that you can also do at home. Let's find out which of the objects I have over here will float and which ones will sink. Let's start with... Pencil. Now, chameleons, what's your guess? Will a pencil float or will it sink? Will it stay on top of the water or will it go under? Let's find out. Ready? As you can see, chameleons, the pencil stayed on top of the surface of water. It floats. Let's try my next object over here. Now this one is a piece of rock. Let's see if the rock will float or sink. Take a smart guess. Ready? If you said sink, then you are definitely correct. It did sink. Now, Let's do some more. I have here a coin. What do you think, chameleons? Will it float or will it sink? Let's try it. Ready for the drop? Whoa! It sinks too! Now, let's try this one over here. It's a leaf. Do you think the leaf will float or will it sink? Let's try it, chameleons. Take a guess. It floats. The leaf stayed on top of the surface of water. What about the next object I have over here? This one is a piece of stick. What do you think, chameleons? Will the stick sink or will it float? Ready? Let's drop it again. The stick stayed on top of the surface of water. It floats. Now, chameleons, what about this paper clip? It's very small. So what do you think? Will it float or will it sink? Ready for the drop? And go! Did you see that, chameleons? The paper clip went under the surface of water. It sank. What about this teaspoon I have over here? I think you already know what will happen. Let's try it. <gasps> Whoa, that was a splash. The teaspoon went under the surface of water. It sinks. Now for our last object, I have here a paper boat. What do you think, chameleons? Will this paper boat float or will it sink? Let's try it. Are you ready with your guess? I am too. 
Ready? And drop! <gasps> Look, chameleons! The paper boat floats! There you have it, chameleons! I hope you enjoy this fun little activity and try it at home! Today we've learned about float and sink. I'll see you all again next time. Have fun!